Thanks for joining us here on Fox 10. I'm Chief Meteorologist Jason Smith tracking our weather headlines here today and this evening. And we're talking about a few clouds around tonight, but no rain looking good there. Real pleasant feeling weather for tomorrow. Temperatures up around 80 degrees and looking ahead, mainly a dry forecast in the days ahead. We're not expecting showers. Looks like a quiet situation weather wise. Today's temperatures at around 80 degrees in Mobile and at Brooklyn Field, 80 in Pensacola, 77 in Gulf Shores and Evergreen. So we do have some mild temperatures out there and looking around the region. You can see clear in the Gulf. We do have a couple of things we're watching in the tropics, though. Two tropical storms on the verge of becoming hurricanes. We've got Lisa here. 65 mile per hour tropical storm could be a hurricane by tomorrow morning tracking towards the Yucatan Peninsula. It may reemerge eventually in the Bay of Campeche, but we don't see it coming towards the northern Gulf based on current trends and modeling and then out further here. We've got Martin, a tropical storm that's likely going to become a hurricane tomorrow, but head for the open waters of the Atlantic. Tomorrow morning's temperature is running at around 57 degrees in Mobile and Daphne, mid 50s Citronel and Bay Minette, low 50s Monroeville, Bruton and Crestview. And our extended forecast tomorrow uh, on up into the 70s pretty quickly. We should be there by about 10 o'clock or so. We get up into the afternoon close to 80 degrees. Here's your extended forecast 81 tomorrow, 81 Thursday. 80 Friday, 81 Saturday. Showers remain isolated Saturday, and then after that, back to dry conditions. Essentially, dry conditions over the next seven days. We've got some great weather ahead. So, uh, beautiful fall-like pattern for the Gulf Coast as we start this month of November.